All right, guys, jumping right into it. 4,419 right now. And we're gonna do some live ladder and see how it goes. See if I can get a successful little push going. And turn up the volume a little bit. All right, so he's gonna minions first play. Um, it could be like Pekka bridge spam. I'm always thinking about like, as soon as I start a match, I'm always thinking like, what could this deck be? And like, how is he gonna try and get damage from here on out? So like right there, he's gonna try and, he's like a bait type of player. I'm not really sure um, why he would go in all like that. Um, okay, so he's gonna Mega Knight, and that makes really no sense because we were up Elixir, so that's why I dropped that Baby Dragon over there. I'm gonna Inferno because he just dropped his um, Zappies over on the left side, and I doubt he has a different reset. So it's going to force something out. And I'm going to ice with the left side. Because those zappies will actually get a lot of damage if you leave them. Um, I think my bowler is going to get one hit. That's good for me. Um, okay, yeah. I'm just going to tornado this to the king tower and take that minion damage. It's only going to be like 500. Yeah, it's only 500 damage. Uh, it's not too bad. <clears throat> and then uh, I think we're at like even elixir right now. I think we have the exact same amount of elixir. So I'm probably just going to, like, Valk. Yeah, I'm going to Valk bottom. And then he's going to drop a Goblin Hut. Hmm, this is a weird deck. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure what this is. I'm going to do a weird play, and I'm going to Graveyard on just, the, on just the Goblin Hut as soon as my Valk crosses the bridge. And I'm going to freeze this. Um, just to try and kill those Zappies. Because they're so annoying. Yep. And I killed the Zappies. Alright, so... Alright, so he's just going to Mega Knight the bridge. And probably just going with minions. Because I don't know what this guy's doing. Uh, we're just going to drop an Ice Wiz. And then a Valk. Yep, okay, so... He wasted a Tornado. I'm not really too sure why he's mad at me. Because he's the one using a really weird deck that makes no sense. Um... We're gonna freeze this at last second just so I can try and kill the Zappies once again. Uh, most annoying card he has. Wow. That Ice Wiz. Okay. Got reset by that Zappy. I'm gonna drop Bowler down low even though it's gonna get splashed because it's gonna kill the Ice Wiz. And then I'm just gonna Valk again. Uh, he can just. I'm not gonna defend the Miner because it's like nothing. And I'm just gonna go in for another graveyard and this is gonna be game. Really nothing he can do about this. Um, I don't even think I'm gonna have to freeze yet. I don't have to freeze. I'm just gonna baby dragon and turn out and predict the Mega Knight, even though there's no time left. Alright. Pretty easy game. I'll give him the well played and some thumbs up. We just well played. Um, gonna jump into the next one. <clears throat> Going against Caesar. Hopefully he's not using Mother Witch. He says good luck. Alright. Um if he doesn't drop anything, I'm gonna cut this out. Alright, there we go. Yeah, I'll just cut out that like 30 seconds of the game because it's fucking boring. Um Alright. So he golem first play. Uh he cycled arrows and log, but I cut it out. Um Alright, so, I'm just going to Ice Wiz and hopefully one Barbarian dies so I can Tornado. I'll have to activate King and I'm going to take a lot of damage right here. He says well played, but um, I hope he doesn't like Lightning. I don't think he has enough. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> a little bit more damage than I wanted, but I think I can defend his pushes in Double Elixir. There's really no way I don't think he can break through. Um, I'm gonna Valk because we're, he's okay. Never mind. I'm gonna Baby Dragon and defend that Skeleton Army, and maybe I should go in here. But um, I'm actually okay. Good thing I didn't. Cause he actually defended that Baby Dragon. I thought he was just gonna go on. Um, <clears throat> that Valk is gonna completely deny all hits, and he's gonna waste a log. So I'm gonna bore, and I'm actually gonna go in for a graveyard. And let's see what he does. 
Wow. He had to cycle arrows, so I'm gonna freeze because he has no arrows in cycle. And I'm actually gonna tornado too. Um, to see. Oh my gosh, okay. So Bowler just killed the wizard. That's super good for me. Um, wow. Okay, he's just gonna continue to try and push this lane. Um, really nothing he can do here. Maybe he does have lightning, or maybe he doesn't. Um, I'm not really too sure. Okay, yeah, there, there comes the lightning. Uh, okay, I was gonna freeze for the Inferno Dragon, but he arrows. And so he just sent, spent 9 elixir to do that. That boar is gonna take care of the wizard. And uh, there's no way he can make it in 4 seconds. And that's basically game. Okay. <clears throat> GG's to Caesar. I kind of hard countered him. That put us to 2900. I'm gonna jump in the last one with Polasso from Warriors. Um, okay, so he's just gonna princess the bridge, so I'm just gonna ice whiz. Probably should have baby dragon, but it's okay. Now I'm gonna baby dragon just so that that Dark Prince kind of dies, I hope. Um, I guess it's not too bad because he dropped uh, Goblin Gang for some- er, <laughs> Rascals for some reason. I'm gonna over defend this, and I think I'm gonna Inferno Dragon all the way up and just kind of see what he does to the Inferno. Um, okay. So he can't do anything about that. Okay, so he's gonna cannon cart and goblin barrel. I'm just gonna tornado that to my king. And hopefully that bowler can take out that cannon cart before it um, gets to my tower. Absolutely perfect timing. Um Okay, so I'm just gonna reset here. Okay, so he's just gonna do the same thing. This time I'm gonna just see what he does. Probably gonna rascals, yep. Okay, so I'm gonna ice this to the to the right side because my king tower is activated now. So if that rascal gets close, it's gonna um, get hit by my king tower. Yep, that's a good tip. So if you activate your king tower, always start start dropping your ice list more towards the middle side. Um, I'm gonna go in with a graveyard here, and I'm just gonna tornado that cannon cart just so it dies on my side. Super annoying card. And, let's see, okay, yeah, so he's gonna pressure. I don't have bar barrel or anything, so I'm actually just gonna let all this damage go. And, uh, I'm gonna reset with a bowler. Okay, so yeah, he's gonna princess and apply some pressure. Force out an inferno dragon. That's okay, because he's gonna defend the bowler, he's gonna have to defend the inferno. Which is, and then it's gonna give the bowler value. I'm just gonna ice whiz, and then get ready for his cannon cart. Okay, I'm gonna baby dragon the cannon cart. And then I'm going to tornado this back, um, just so everything dies. Okay, and then I'm going to Valk the bridge and actually go in for a graveyard here, knowing that he just wasted a lot of his good counters. And then I'm going to freeze at zero. Okay, and he just wasted his snowball, so now he has no spell. He has a goblin barrel on defense, that Valk is going to get to the tower. Yep, and that's game, there's just no way he can break through. And, uh, he just wasted his goblin barrel, so he really can't even go on offense. Um, and I'll just tornado his goblin barrel away if he does cycle to it. You can just block on top of that, and then that's game. Um, GG's to him. Bunch of weird decks today. Not really too sure. And let's see where that put us.